to go to the farmer's market today but last weekend I don't know if you guys watched our Instagram story but last weekend we had a it wasn't a bad experience really people were being super a lot of people were trying to stop and talk and take pictures of Fairby and calling her and stuff no one was rude to us at all everyone was super super nice but for me because of all the stuff that I have you know going on with me it's very overwhelming to be kind of um, bombarded by that many people people were just literally would not leave us alone even though i'd love to go because it's really nice temperature out one of the markets that we have around here they actually have like a little craft fair thing they also have like food farmers market stuff and then they have a scarecrow thing up right now where you can go and see all the different scarecrows they're decorated for charity stuff and like i'm pretty sure you can vote on like which one's the best and it's just really cute and also usually they have live music there pretty much it's a park you can kind of go into any day and there's going to be something going on but because of our experience last weekend, I just feel like, I don't know, it kind of made me feel like that whenever we do go back, like, I'm going to face that again. And I'm just not in the mood for it today. Which is a really, it's a huge shame that you can't just go out and, like, you know, not be harassed. Like I've said before, it reminds me of, like, rape culture where if you're an attractive woman and you have, on, like, you know, skimpy clothes or something that you basically are going to be harassed. That's what it reminds me of. Um, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know what we're going to do. I would love to do something outdoorsy. Hopefully we'll get into something cool. I don't know what you guys can hear, but we uh, came to one of the parks to do some training um, because there's actually a really, really big water fountain thing, which hopefully I got some good footage of it, but there's a really big water fountain thing. It is super loud and therapy is a dog who loves water. So I thought it would be cool to do some training around that. Um, she always is super distracted around it. So that's what we're doing. 